I'm Benny Ming, the curator of the Wen Chun Museum. Welcome to our Wen Chun series of Wen Chun tapes. First series we have done is based on one of the most popular versions of modern day Wen Chun, which is the Yip Mun's Wen Chun. This particular series features one of the most unique and special Wen Chun systems, today known as the Shaolin Jisi Wen Chun. According to the museum's research, the Jisim system might be one of the oldest versions of the Wen Chun that came directly from the Southern Shaolin, which is the sister art with the Hongfai Wen Chun, and it's related to the modern day version of Wen Chun and also related to the Hangar system, Hong Kun. These treasures of Shaolin Jisim Wen Chun come from directly in the Southern Shaolin temple. Uh, within the Southern Shaolin Temple, there's a hall called a Wen Chun Hall. Okay, but this Wen Chun is Everlasting Spring, which is different from today's popular version of Praising Spring Wen Chun Hall. This tape is not only the first tape on the GC Wen Chun, but it also features the successor and the grandmaster of the system which is Grandmaster Andreas Hoffman. German-born Andreas Hoffman is the official inheritor of the Wing Chun system. It has been Andreas Hoffman's privilege to undergo a traditional master's training under the guidance of the late great Grandmaster of Wing Chun Kung Fu in his homeland of China and Hong Kong. Andreas Hoffman traveled as a teenager in the 80s to Hong Kong following and trusting his inner voice, Sifu Cheng Kuang planted the first roots of various Kung Fu styles into the young Westerner and exercised enormous patience in familiarizing Andrea Hoffman with Chinese culture and religion. He was like a father to Andrea Hoffman and was his family in China. Since 1986, the leading Grandmaster Wai Yun taught Wing Chun in its purest form to Andreas Hoffman and allowed him to sense how effective Wing Chun is through countless locks, throws, and blows. It was a great honor for Andrea Hoffman that Grandmaster Wai Yun accepted him as the last student in the Mecca of Wing Chun Kung Fu, Dai Duk Lan. From that day onward, the entire knowledge of Dai Duk Lan was passed on to him during countless hours of private tuition in 1988 and in 1995. Grandmaster Wai Yun, Master Cheng Kuang, presented Andrea Hoffman with a certificate declaring him to be a Grandmaster and thus the official successor in the long series of Wen Chun Grandmasters reaching back to the South Shaolin Temple. The heritage of Wing Chun Kung Fu was thus passed to Andreas Hoffman, one of the famous old Wing Chun grandmasters, Pak Chung. After long and thorough searches, Andreas Hoffman began the adventurous journey to Fat San and studied Wing Chun Kung Fu with his old master. In 1999, Sifu Tang Chung Pak, the great nephew and successor of Grandmaster Tang Yik, one of the main teacher of Dai Duk Lan, learned about Andreas Hoffman's worldwide Wing Chun activity and invited him to Hong Kong. After extensive tests to establish whether he was truly a grandmaster of Wing Chun Kung Fu, Sifu Tang Chung Pak made the entire family treasure of the Tang family who can trace their forefathers back to the Abbot Chi Sim available to him. <laughs> 